In today's video, we're going to find out if your house uses natural gas or LPG tanks to fuel your home. When filling in a quote at the iHeat website, you will be asked what fuel powers your home. And this is quite a tricky question if you've never done one before. This is so that when we get to the job, we know how big it's going to be and what kind of boiler we need to order for your property. If you have LPG gas, you will need an LPG conversion kit added to your boiler for it to work inside your home. LPG is short for liquefied petroleum gas, and it's normally either butane or propane, depending on where you are in the country. Both gases have different boiling points, which means they are better for indoor or outdoor usage. Natural gas is primarily methane which is delivered to your house using mains gas pipes. This will feed into a gas meter inside your property, normally found under the stairs or in a cupboard outside your property. This is where the gas is measured to know how much to charge you every single month for your gas usage. On the flip side, LPG is delivered in large tanks which are on the side of your property with pressure gauges above. This makes it rather easy to work out what kind of gas you have as you'll either have massive tanks on the side of your house which you can't really miss or you'll have a gas meter underneath your stairs which you'll probably see and it's normally covered in dust too. Another big difference is with one, you'll have a big gas bill every month. So this is when you have gas mains. Whereas with LPG, you'll have to order these quite regularly. So maybe monthly or every two months, you'll get a new delivery of gas tanks into your property for you to use for those two months. If you've just moved into a property and you have these LPG tanks at the side of your house, you need to find out how to order more as you'll run out pretty quick. So natural gas or LPG? Which one is better? At the moment, the better gas is whatever gas you can get to your property. LPG tanks are normally found for rural properties in maybe farmland or really high up where you just can't get a gas mains pipe too. Mains gas is efficient, cost effective and does burn rather clean. LPG is more expensive as you have to cover the cost of delivery and if you run out on an emergency basis, you've got to pay that extra fee to get one delivered in an emergency. The only times your mains gas will run out is if you're on a prepaid meter and it's not in credit or if the planet has actually just run out of natural gas and this will eventually happen as it is not renewable. If you do care about your carbon footprint, neither mains gas or LPG is the way to go. You need to start looking to renewable energy sources such as solar PV. Overall, if you have a gas meter inside your property, this means you have mains gas or natural gas and if you have big tanks outside your house this means you have LPG it's quite a simple calculation to do. If you currently have access to mains gas, I wouldn't recommend switching over to LPG as it costs a lot more. But if you do have LPG tanks and you aren't very rural, I'd probably find out why you don't have access to mains gas as it can be cheaper for you. Hopefully this has helped you distinguish what type of fuel powers your home. And you can now finish off your eye heat quote. If you have any questions, do leave them in the comments down below and I'll see you in the next video. This has been eye heat.